today's program, our poet laureate, R.B. Morris, has written a poem that appropriately describes the powerful emotion that we feel when we stand next to a timeless river. Please give a hearty welcome to R.B. Norris. Morris. Thank you. Only now can I stand beside the river and begin to see. Only now do I know the world is turning. In the shadow of the city, in the bright air of the sun, we are turning. And look, it's a new season. It's way ahead of us. It's like someone left us here in a garden, and now it's blossoming. And look, there's a river. It comes, it goes, it stays. It is endless in all directions. In an age of flash, in an age of fake, in the great age of miscommunication, who can stand where they are and move forward like the river? The river has no choice, and neither do we. We must flow. We must go forward, even as we stay where we are even as the world turns. We are the urban wilderness, lost and finding ourselves. Hear our cry, hear our song. We sing to push the river along. In the life of the river, we are but a moment. We're like flowers blossoming on the bank, like trees with new leaves. We rise and fall. Another season that comes and goes while the river flows on. What can we do but sing a river hymn and tend this garden? Only now can we do this. You can't put your hand in the river in the same place twice, or as a poet said, in the same place once. It moves, it goes, even as it stays. And so must we. These are our days to push the river, to turn the world. Our season, to stand where we are, and move forward. 